Elle est laissée villa. Oui, les je suis deux. Maman, oh Dieu, âme je vois. Best city after oh what the heck? what's that? Nevi! Run! Nevi! <laughs> Nevi, just Nevi. like they said. Ah okay. oh, shit. Hey, they look really different in this too. Definitely an upgrade. Oh right, where I'm at is Welcome back everyone! <laughs> We're starting yeah. grep. In case oh. you thought you'd never see me again, well, to quote Cell, too bad, I'm alive. <laughs> and for this recording session, I'll be Raven. This thing is supposed to be draw, uh, draw a Nevi, and it's my job to take them out. Once we trap enough of them into all the machines, we'll have enough energy, we need to start the experiment. And, and I guess, I guess I'll be Cat for this time around, and a few extras. <laughs> yeah, you know, that'll be fun. You'll be Cat and some extras. I'll just be. Was there an actual villain in this thing before? Well, oh, I right, right. The... Those, those two. Yeah. But yeah, last time for Gravity Rush, like I did some coasting for the last episodes. Yep. But this time, sure. but this time around, I feel like I might be a permanent fixture here, given what my schedule might be. Yeah. Zaza, Blade. Episode 1, Red and Black. The thumbnail I tried to recreate and got pretty close! Yep. Where they set up the next one again? Need to get a better look. Maybe from higher up. Yeah. Let me get a look from here. The camera. Also, Where am I looking? Like, given that the is. short nature of this DLC, I doubt there will be that much for gem talk, but I just want to say, like, nah. for this game yep. in general, I just love how they continue using this fictional language a bit more. Oh, uh, yeah. For, like, just to give the viewers at home, like, some specifics. Uh, we're just randomly doing this now. Just, for, just like, the way it thinks, like, the intro being super late was any indication. We're gonna kind of do this on the fly, cause before this, and as you saw, I was just doing. Oh, that would come from the sky. We're gonna take him out. We're doing some sync testing. Whoa! You know, I never tried it before, but there's also this thing. Oh, that's right. I forgot you could do that. There's this yeah, thing where you can glitch yourself into being Raven. 
Oh, oh, so that explains how people are able to play yep. as a raven in, like, cat's section. Yep. I don't know how, but there is a video, and I looked that up later for sure. Where'd the other one go? Also, I just like how her blue orbs are called blue jays. Nice. Well, I keep... I don't know what's up with that, but... Oh, shit. Raven definitely plays a little different. She's got more of a drill kick than anything else. That should be enough. Like her own miniature spiral claw, except less powerful. Yeah, instead of a claw, it's a drill. Which, arguably, can be more powerful, depending. I mean, good luck on this show and how overpowered drills can be. Oh, hell yeah. Alright, let's just get this thing right here. Uh, Raven, I've got bad news. Love it. Raven, I just got a report that some of the thugs... Uh, that some thugs were over at the first site. <laughs> They've been taken care of. Oh! Th they have? Oh, that's good news. Oh, Riva. Can you believe him? What kind of heartless criminals would get in the way of saving those children in the Ark? Who knows, but I won't let anyone else stop the experiment. See, si. Glad to hear it. I need to get to the next machine. See, si. Yes, ma'am. I'll tell the others to, wa to keep up their watch. Now, we really couldn't do this without you and the other shifter. Do do ya. Now, we'll have all the energy we need in no time with your help. Done. Now to get to the next machine. Yeah, they are really like using the language a lot more in like just these small cutscenes too. Oh. Exactly. Exactly. Blood I mean, talent powers. I mean, you and also like we talked about like in detail about like how gr this how about how this language is all unique, like a mixture of French and Japanese. But yeah, it's so nice to actually hear it be spoken. Especially later on in the main game, considering how short this DLC is. Oh, yeah. <laughs> also, the amount of stuff that Raven can actually hold is insane. Alright, where's the next one at? Oh, that's a cool way to start that. That take care of the Nevi. Oh, I thought she did a little flip when she did that. I'm trying to do the gravity slide with her. And I thought she started off with a little flip. But I guess not, though, just in the moment. Alright, let's collect this. Alright. The next machine should be the last one. Also, I... When I first played this DLC, I kind of did it after Gravity Rush 2 and thought it might have uh, been yeah. a technical sequel since... But I, I'm, I'm just not going to spoil anything for Gravity Rush 2 since we're starting it now. Yeah, the only thing you, only thing worth spoiling about the DLC is this is definitely something you should be playing before Gravity Rush 2. Let's see, Raven's high pressure power. Raven's SP God fills the church's enemy that takes damage. When SP God is filled, she can unleash a special attack. And that button would be a triangle button. Same as all the super attacks. Sweet. All right. I mean, it looks cool and all, but definitely nowhere near as cool as the attacks Cat can do. But then again, that comes from my personal bias towards the Gravity Queen. Oh yeah. I do wish we could actually play Raven more other than in the DLC. Yeah, Although with me, the me too. because I never uh, because I never tried to glitch, I don't know if you can actually use Raven's abilities or not, or if it's just like basically a reskin. Oh. No, I think it's like a full on. Like, you can actually genuinely play as Raven. Even <laughs> use her for abilities. Oh, oh wait, I mean, don't... Has... Go for it. Because, I mean, it yeah, has, yeah. like, her same sound effects and all, so... Oh. Ah, I didn't know that. I never really looked at any images. Ah, oh, that's the last tank I need. I never looked... I never looked at any videos I meant. I've only ever seen, like, screenshots. And I was like, how the hell do you do that? And never bothered to look it up. But Satya. Maybe. Oh. Huh? Zaza. Satya. Satya. Satya, where are you? I must keep seeing things. How could Zaza be here? This is all my fault. I should have tried harder. 
I was supposed to protect her. No, it's my fault. Sachia. I gotta find her. Sachia! Sachia! Zaza and the others must be trapped in a nightmare. Zaza. Zaza, hold on. Leila. I'll do whatever it takes to bring you back. Lashui. Bima. And you'll see me again. I promise. Zaza! Zaza, wait! Once I deliver this, I could bring Zaza back home. What are you doing here? Time to oh, replace my rule. Yeah. Hurry, Raven! Is this all to help those kids sleeping in New York? <clears throat> Sorry to bother you, but we need to chat. Gabe, Sienna, can't we do this later? I'm busy. Uh, oh, yes, but this is an important problem. Speaking of which, we need to talk about the Ark. The whole plan to rescue the children is giving me bad vibes. Not just like the disco ball. Oh, yeah. And space time is having a fit. It's like it all can. Like, it's like it can all tell something bad is about to happen. Do you even try to make sense? No. I feel. So sleepy. Oh. Hmm. Sounds like the Dream Guardian is about to join our conversation. Mind if I voice his Dream Guardian? See. Yeah, go for it. Sayonara is asleep. The children in the Ark are trapped in a place between reality and dreams. Oh, no, nah, that's different then. Not the dreams only... and reality. <laughs> go for it. <laughs> the only way to wake them is to guide them to where they belong. Getting them back is exactly what I was doing before you interrupted me. The scientist in charge said that, with enough energy, he could restart the Ark and bring them back to where they belong. Ralphie. Sounds reckless to me. Dinner. Playing with time and space isn't a good idea. Leave him. You of all people should understand the risks. Your very existence is an instability. But you're the one who told me that time was coming when they would rise again. The time was coming when they would rise again. What do you want me to do? Sit back and wait for them to wake up? Okay. While you both do nothing, I'm going to save Zaza and the others. I had to. You've already wasted enough of my time. Oh, is you? Hmm. She does have a temper. We, we did warn her. The rest is up to the third create. But uh, you, you can go back to voice and break other side now. What? Was I sleeping again? I'm sorry. Shall we? Hey, we all need a little shut eye now and again. Let's go see how this will play out. Now I need to drop off his energy. Yeah, as for the uh, the third creator. Hmm. hmm. Let's see who should voice him. Yeah, I'm still not sure myself. But seeing as how you're uh, taking Sienna from me, I'll probably take the third creator. <laughs> well, let me know I'm only taking half of Sienna. You're getting the regular one, I'm getting her dream guardian. Half price off. Uh, it's my queen! My queen's <laughs> back! <laughs> there she is. Raven! Hey, Raven! Lakira. Raven, do you get here too? Oh, yeah. Yeah, and I brought the energy we need. Oh. I was wondering if you would ever show up. Hold on. Energy levels are good. We should be able to commence the uh, experiment. Would you? I feel it's worth bringing it to your attention. But today's experiment is all thanks to my boss, Dr. Brahman. Or Brahman. When today is done, he'll be famous. Oh. I just need to rush these energy tanks over there. Thank you for your good work. Huh. Yeesh. Makes it sound like all this is just for... Like, it's just a line for some guy's resume. Guess we've done all we could. Let's over to the plaza and join the crowd. Gaiden Sinea should be there already. Too bad Sid had to take today of all days to call in sick. Yeah, that sucks. Hmm. Yeah, I wonder what that could be. 
Can you believe him taking such an important day off? He's probably off flirting again. Cat, do you really think this will wake the children in the ark? Huh? Having second thoughts? You were the one who was all for the experiment. I'm sure everything will turn out all right. You're right. And I'll do whatever it takes to bring them home. Yeah, you're acting kind of strange today. Are you all right? Hmm. Let's go! I wouldn't want you to miss the chance to see Zaza. Plan to rescue our children. Experiment takes place in Freedom Square. Months have passed since bringing the children from Boutine back home to Hexville. But their passage through the Rift Plan has brought us, brought us back, left them in hibernation state. The scientist said he, uh, he had a solution for waking them. And he needed my cat's help to pull out the experiment. Hold on, Saza. I'll bring you home. Whatever it takes. And I'm sure the scientist can be trusted. Yeah, I mean, uh, the last one might have been a fluke, but hey, this guy seems on the up and up. Yeah, I mean, he has a pretty cool monocle, so that means with a monocle like that, you could easily trust a person like that. And that mustache, yeah. too! Oh, definitely. <laughs> All we can do now is hope that this wakes Zaza and the others. Yeah. And well, the, as, uh, I'll take this dude here. Okay. We're just winging it. We're just winging it. And as a result, we have a way to free the sleeping children from their temporal prison. Now let's. Uh, excuse me. Oh, oh, that auction exists. You go. Uh, you won't get the results you're looking for from an illusion. What? What? What did you come from? Although sometimes bad methods can bring about good results. Going through with your experiment will certainly shake things up. Uh, pardon me, is anyone missing a little scientist here? Oh, I know where you're hiding, but I'll let it slide for now. What the? No more. He went quite fast. Wonder what's wrong. Not sure, but it's starting. So has the Ark been parked up there the whole time? Yep. Okay then. Don't worry, we had to tie down. Wait, I thought there was no. Oh wait, that was a control panel, not a door. Yep. No, there is no door. Not as you have imagination. And, you know, third eye. That helps too. Right. Thanks to some divine intervention. We now return to Gravity Rush. Starting out with Raven's story. As she is collecting the energy needed to wake the children. The creators visit her with worry about the experiment. And the start of that. Things take a sudden turn. Coming up, another creator and a trip down memory lane. Until then, see you in the next one.